You know what? I want to, I wanted to talk to you about something that came in. I can, that I can tell that you are different whenever you're not here on a on a planned schedule, man. You know, JJ, it's. Uh, I was telling the boys. Uh, I, can, I guess I can talk about it in front of Don. Don's close to you too. Don, don't you do don't it. you feel like Joaquin is very like he's a very structured person and never can chill. You know, he always has somewhere else to go to. You know what I'm saying? But he can chill. Like, he can chill. And uh, he can chill after he's done with the six runs he does on the day. <laughs> That's his fucking problem. He's not like me. You know, I wake up not knowing what I'm gonna do. You know what I'm saying? But he he can't he can't do it. You know what I mean? I like planning shit, man. Yeah, that's yeah. I was I was trying to tell people you know, uh, two days ago, like I was trying to find a metaphor, and I realized because I've been playing a lot of games in my apartment, that basically JJ is like a party leader, you know, and he exactly. he needs to get it going, but he doesn't Literally realize. Literally or meta metaphorically? <laughs> both. 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 <laughs> Come, JJ. You wanted to talk about something? Yeah. Why not? Private, right? Because KJ, 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 kind of minus one thousand. So. Okay. Go on. I'm here. All right. So, listen, listen, listen. I know you might have a, a strong opinion about someone. Okay. All right. But, like, can your opinion change in six months? Say that. I like give the person. In six changed. months? What the fuck are you talking about, dumb fuck? Yeah. Because KJ was like, it's a no from me. And I'm like, motherfucker, like, I'm not like asking him to, to, uh, join Seaside off the get go. Like, if this motherfucker needs to prove himself to me first before I even suggest him at okay, all. Okay. Okay. But I told him, like, uh, like, I asked, actually asked him, like, uh, why, why he was kicked out of, uh, GG. Because okay. I'm interested. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not planning on fucking getting people on Seaside that are dumb at, like, even though his name is dumbfuck or whatever, like, I'm not planning on adding, so, like, even suggesting or putting my name on the line for one motherfucker that's about mm -hmm. to throw everything in the in the trash. Mm -hmm. So, he said that he did, it was a lot of small mistakes that added up over time, and then Marty got sick of it. So, I asked him if he learned from his mistakes. He said he did, and he was a dumbass. And um, I left it at that, you know? And, uh... I told KJ that, like, I'm not trying to, like, get him on Seaside within, like, the next 30 days. Like, like he would be, like, for me even to suggest him to be a hangaround, it would take months and months and months of improving himself. No, I get, I, listen, JJ, I get that, man. Like, you, you know me. I'm not somebody that just, I want to give everybody a chance, right? But obviously, with yeah. dumb fuck, there's a lot of baggage there because... You know, I think he got he got removed from GG not once but maybe twice. He fucked yeah. up with the mariachis and shit like that too, and that's fucking Speedy who's barely fucking around. You know, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. and to me that just you know th those are red flags. I'm not saying they run their gangs perfectly, but at the same time, you you know you gotta be doing something extra extra spicy or extra crazy or silly to be removed from those situations, right? And you're the kind of guy that usually you play you you make the safe bet you know what i mean yeah you yeah, made it why like I'm, I'm not planning on risking my name for him like if he if i'm not 100 percent sure that he has changed you know didn't he join so, yokai like, or some shit or did he do jobs with you guys uh he, no he's done jobs with seaside like he does the ulrich chorus basically i heard that I, he was in the I middle of some uh gang shootout uh racist shootout thing Oh yeah, he's trying to join Yokai, like uh, as like uh, like uh, on the racing crew. So, uh, well, Terry was there, I was there, and then Mary was there. Mm. Uh, so that that ended just was one shootout, by the way. We clapped Tony and Goofy. That was that was pretty bad. Anyway, and Mickey. Anyways, like mm. I was saying. I don't know why you keep that, on bringing that, that up. You must be really happy that happened. Listen, listen, like I said, the war general. You, you, you're 99. just lucky I wasn't there because I would have clapped the shit out of Yokai. What are you talking about? I, I wouldn't have I wouldn't have been part of that shootout. Okay, go go on. Um Well like I was saying, like I was telling KG, like it's so hard to get shit going, like for uh, for us lately. Like at least when you go to sleep. Because like I have to be the one who who basically spearheads everything, right? And like organizes everything. Okay. And uh, g gets things sorted. And like after weeks of trying, I finally found like 
a group that I can shift in and out so I can get the boys up good and uh, I can actually help them out to stop being broke motherfuckers, right? Like, I've, I've helped Terry out, I've helped Smalls mm -hmm. out. Like, and uh, I try... Uh, basically, I've, I've been working on learning myself, like, the oil rig hacks so I can actually do most of them, right? Uh, to get myself in a position where I can bring the most use out people that I can in those runs. Okay, okay. I, listen, I get you, but then let me ask you this. What yeah. if if you were in a situation where some of the boys were around and then all oh, you could do everything, would you even consider dumb fuck? Well, if he's been if he's been helping us for like months, I mean, it would be fucked up if I just like push him to the side. You know what I mean? It sounds I'll be honest with you. I think dumb fuck would actually shine if you just did something like the soy boys or something, man, where you had a little high group instead. No, I mean, I like, if, I mean, because, like, then it if feels worse comes like, to worse, it, it feels like dissected. You know what I mean? And I don't want to feel that way. It is already it dissected. Like, what are you talking about? Every job that we plan, if you if you if you feel like you can't uh, muster up a group and, you know, comfortably, you're already dissecting things and trying to get everything going. Right. What do you mean? I felt though, like just like to practice, like for us to like learn the hacks and shit, like and like just like to learn as a group of CISA as a whole, like like we've done, like, I don't know, like over 10 runs of just like just practicing us like a seaside and like there's some shit that i just can't do like thermite i it's fucking hard for me man and yeah like, I, I think all, I all i'm bar, all i'm saying I, to I, you I, I can do most of them like like no 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 I, all i'm saying to you right now is i you know i i understand where you're coming from okay and i already told the boys like to understand the way you work and but i just want you to get like how we think too okay and it's not it's nothing bad it's just more like I get what you're trying to do with Dumbfuck. I understand why you would want to consider him for Seaside because then you could pocket him for all of us, right? But I think the things that we need to remember is that things change very drastically when when times change, literally. Like the only reason that we're not chilling out and doing stuff every day is because we've fucking done everything. No. You, you, you know what I mean? We've done everything. Like... When the oil rig came about, you were waking up every day doing it with us. When it was the casino, when it was a vault, it was the same shit, right? We, when the when 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 you need to roll out with the right people, we got it. It's just right now, it's a very slow time in the city, and a lot of the boys that used to do all the fucking hacking are multimillionaires through the roof, right? I think it's yeah, just well, the people it, that it's are just around. That. They're fucking broke, up, broke as fuck, man. Like Terry's broke as fuck. Smalls is broke as fuck. Like, yeah, so I mean, helping ten, them out. Small should be okay. He did out. he did an oil rig recently, right? Yeah, he did an oil rig with me. So like, he should his back should be good today. Dragon right? should have like a million dollars. He he did the same shit as well. I think the only people that are broke might just be uh, might be, I think Axel. No, Axel should have the money from his car. Fredo, I know Fredo might be broke. MPs, I think okay. Fredo, MP, and. There's somebody else I'm thinking about. I haven't seen MP in like two weeks, man. Yeah, MP is going through that phase where he got a little bit too addicted to the city. And then, you know, uh, he's like chilling out. Axel. Yeah. Axel's broke as shit. No. All right, I'll get, no, I'll get Axel tomorrow. Yeah, listen, then, man. No, I, it, it's not. Well, like, all, I'm, all I'm going to tell you is. Like... All I'm going to tell you is. Number one, I feel like having a high screw or having somebody that can be close to you. And if, if he's already going to be in Yokai, that's technically a connection you have anyway. And if he doesn't want to do, do jobs with Seaside because he's not a part of Seaside, I think that'd be kind of weird at the same time. And listen, I'm not going to just shut you down here because I know you hate that kind of shit, but it will be difficult because I know a lot of people would say no. Like, I wouldn't even vote on it first so that people wouldn't follow my vote. You know what I I'm mean, saying? Like, like I said, like... Uh... He needs to prove himself to me to, for me to even like put my name on the line for him. And like, he's just one of those people that like feeds off the energy of other people. So like, if he hangs out with GG, he's an absolute crackhead. Like, if he would, uh, and, but like, when he hangs out with me and like other people, and like Terry, he's, he's chill. I don't know. Like, it's just like, I, I, yeah, I, just I get don't it. I see get the it. The issues that like, that other people see. You know what I mean? I don't know. It's, it's just, I don't know. All right. Is there anything else that you wanted to talk about? Or are you good? Um. Uh. 
you know, I, I just want to talk a little bit about the the whole like not helping, like or like telling like asking Reggie to tell me more details and like I didn't helping initially on the first day. Mm -hmm. Um. And then like I found out like it was for Michael and like. I I'm gonna be honest with you, Benji. Like I know that he's a council member. I know that he's he said, but like. It hurt me a lot seeing him like. He Kiss. never chilled with the boys. Stop baiting like, too much. You're actually starting I saw to annoy him in me. A race before, like it was even announced. Months, just time him out right? for like a that, day. That, if like, it was, like by Miguel, that like he was like alive and shit. He was just chilling with Lexi. Uh, taking her as a passenger princess, racing in a yokai race, like and he was barely messed up. He had like the same mask that you had. He had no hat. He had no voice. Sorry, changer. sorry. I got I, I got angry about something in my head. Can you repeat that? Oh my God, Benji. I got. Well, listen, I have to police here, man. Okay, hold on. Um. Okay, so basically the whole like um. So, I don't know, like uh, with, like just just bring the point instead of like uh doing a whole story. Like, I wish that Michael would chill more with the boys and get to know the boys instead of just like. Instead of just hanging out with everybody and their mother. Because, like, when he was, like, presumed dead, like, I saw him. I was wearing yoga gear, so he didn't know I was there in the race. He was chilling with the mask that you're wearing, without a hat, without a voice changer. And he was just chilling with Lexi when most of the people in CSAT still thought that he was dead. You know what I mean? Mm hmm And, and I... I feel like if he's been, if he was just racing, chilling with Lexi, like who has been, he, who has he been chilling with when he was dead before even most of Seaside knew that he was alive? You know what I mean? It, yeah, it's but like... <clears throat> you have to understand something, okay? The whole thing about Michael and the shit that he's been doing, bro, like a point, a massive point has been proven from our actions. And that was my main purpose of doing things the way I went about it. I didn't, I barely talk. I didn't even talk to, I told KJ, but I, I didn't talk about it with anybody or didn't even bring it up for myself. I didn't even think about that shit because number one, the Simone brothers have re come to realize that their friends, their friends ain't really their friends. You get what I'm saying? And that is a point that I needed to be shoved up their fucking noses. So they fucking stopped acting like they're, everything's going to be fine and everybody would just back them. And at the end of the day, that the people that will actually back them are going to be their day ones, people like me. And through me, it will be people like Seaside. And don't get me wrong. I understand that they need to make an extra effort. Or Michael needs to make an extra effort to, to get the, what do you call this? The rapport with the boys. You know what I'm saying? Like, don't. And I've already mentioned that to him, man. And that's why he's communicating with people like Dragon and shit like that. And I'll be honest with you. It's not, it's probably not easy for him because he's been in the, on the run for the last year, pretty much. And every time he throws his burner phones away, he probably forgets all the numbers, man, you know? But that, that still doesn't excuse it because I, told, I tell him the same shit. I tell him the same shit. Like, you know, Seaside will be here for you because I asked them to be, you know? But if yeah. you want them to be there and naturally, I, I you have to... I will do shit for him. You know, I like, get it. I get it. I will, I will drop things in a second. Like, if, But like, will I drop it for Michael? Like, as of right now? No. Will I drop it because you're asking me? Yes. That's and what I, I'm saying. You know what I mean? Like, That's what I'm saying. I get it. I get it completely, man. I, and I and I wish it wasn't that way because I want to get to know the guy, and I want like Seaside and like the rest of the boys to get to know him, because like if if he's one of your best friends, like he must be a good guy. So I just I just want the rest of the family to get to know him too, and you know I don't know. Yeah. Well, I mean, for now, well, for the in the past, you know, he's my he's done a lot for me, and he's uh, you know. One of my day ones, man. What can I say? And I appreciate you guys always yeah, rolling out no matter what. But it's something that he needs to change. I agree. I don't even... There's no problem with that. And I think he's doing it, but slowly. No. He just needs to start actually being a part of everything that we do, even though he might not understand it all because he's not usually around during AU or when I am, right? Yeah. Also, I don't know what the fuck happened yesterday, but... I've been, I've been always been really careful with my warehouse, right? With uh, Cass. Okay. Like, nobody, like, only only a few people know about the warehouse. And, like, they're mostly, like, I mean, Gora knew, but uh, she was blotted out. And, like, uh, I... Wait, what happened? Other than that, 
bro, like, we were fucking, like, cast, like, uh, um, Jess was telling Cass to come with me to the warehouse. We fu she fucking found a motion sensor on the door of the warehouse. How come? The fuck? I don't fucking know, man. Like, I don't know, like, I'm trying to figure out, like, what, uh, why, like, uh, like, I don't know if it was, like, related to the transport that we did. Like, I don't know if it was related to anything like that. But, like, there was a motion sensor in the fucking door. So we just grabbed a couple things, like, the rest of the guns that I had in the warehouse. and like Somebody tried to fuck with you. Yeah, I, yeah, I guess. I don't know. Interesting. You, and I don't know. Who's what, your like, warehouse I under? Mean, like, Jess. Just barely even around, so it's probably not her. Probably you. Interesting. Being watched. Yeah, and I don't know why, because like, I'm fucking careful. Like, I, I, I always block out when I go to the warehouse. I always close it. I always park under a bridge. Like, I'm, I'm there for like a max of like one minute. I dip. I, I don't visit it often. Cass is the same way. Like, she's fucking careful as shit. So like I just, I just don't know how a motion sensor just started being put in there. You know what I mean? I don't know. There, Shaft. Thank you for the two years. All right. Okay. Just make sure you're careful. Then make sure you fucking watch out what's going on. You've been yeah, who like, you been I'm doing shit with there. anyway? Uh, mainly, mainly Yoka and, and uh, Yoka. Don't fucking see set. That's it. I'm uh, just sticking with my circle. That's it. Okay. Listen, I I want you to understand something, okay, JJ. Mm -hmm. I know the shit when when it comes to KJ, Reggie, the other the others in the council and shit like that. It's so tough for me, bro, because you guys are different types of people. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You, you know what I mean? Like you're you're proactive in 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 the jobs and whatever. KJ's proactive in disciplining people. Reggie's proactive in acting like an asshole and trying to make sure these hangarounds and the full members don't get out of hand and shit like that but if i'm being honest with you i i told him this and i'm gonna tell it to you too you all, you all need to hang out together a little bit more man like i i don't know what it will take i don't know how to convince you guys but you all need to just be together a little bit more naturally bro because you guys will be something to be fucked with okay nobody will be wanting to fuck with y'all if you're actually together all the time man like the, the amount of days that I wake up or I stay up a little bit longer and I see you with your crew. I see KJ fucking jacking off with Mario somewhere, somewhere. And Reggie just like going against couch, just smacking him. Like the council, you guys need to be together even when I'm not. And I'm not saying that one person has to be the one pushing for it. But I think you guys just need to be conscious about that. You know what I mean? The thing with KJ is that like I... He he tries to get on my nerves, right? He hits a nerve, and like I I I I I clap back got back a bit, you know, like and then like he escalates and the shit keeps going higher, higher, higher to the point that I get triggered and I'm like, all right, I'm done, kind of thing. Yeah, I know, I know. Listen, JJ, I know how you are, okay? I know how you are. It's 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 very, ah, bro. Y'all need to fucking fuck me dead. You guys are like a bunch of high school kids that need to talk shit in the back of the class, bro. Fuck me. No, it's okay. I mean, I... No, it's not okay, man. That's that's the one thing that we lack, bro. You don't get me, man. Like, Seaside is stronger when you guys are rolling together, bro. The amount of experience, the people that you guys know as a, as a team is what trumps most people in the fucking city, bro. Well, whenever, whenever I hang out with KJ, like, and he's in business, I'm like, okay. One second, phone call, and then he just like runs runs away. One second, I gotta do business, and then like like drives away, and I'm like, why the fuck am I hanging out with him when he's like doing that shit all the time? Like fuck that. Like I'll, I'd rather just roll roll out, like and do my own shit. You know, like I'm not like some like like I'm just gonna like stay there, like and just wait. Like uh, it's it's annoying as shit. And you guys need to do it together, man. You do your annoying shit together. He does his annoying shit together. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but he's like, oh, I gotta do some business. And then like, okay, all right. See, see you in like 
10 minutes, oh, I got a phone call. No, and you're right. You're right. I don't think, uh, I, listen, JJ, I make fun of you a lot, but I don't think you're necessarily wrong with this shit. He is a little bit of a fucking yip yapper. My no. God. Fucking rats, bro. <laughs> Wait, what happened? Chat, one minute, one minute 45, chat. Nothing. I'm, I'm just thinking about this shit, you know, because. What are those bikes in the helipad? Those are cops doing a trial, I think. Oh, what the fuck? Or maybe they're starting a race. I'm not sure. But you got, you get what I'm saying, right? It's like, yeah, I know, I know. Everybody, saying, like, you, y'all, y'all, uh, y'all forgot how to hang out with each other, man. And it sucks to see. Yeah. It sucks to see. Like, if I'm around, yeah, sure, you know, everybody will just be there. But that, that's the thing. A majority of the council are around after I go to sleep. You know, I hang out with Smalls. I hang out with Dragon. I listen to their shit. They listen to my shit. You know what I mean? And then our yeah. our our oldest members end up getting annoyed with each other because they're making fun of each other too much, or one is too busy, or one is doing too many jobs. One wants to work with cops and fucking scold them. You know? That's what it is, man. But then we're losing the essence of the whole fucking plan if you guys can't be together, man. Because it'll, it'll, it will end up, JJ, okay? If if there is no family hanging out, okay? I might as well just recruit 12 people that know how to go to war. And whenever I need them, I call them. Sign a contract with me, that's we it. We have that already. I'm pretty sure we have that already. No, I know. But the thing is, I don't want it to be robotic, man. You know what I'm saying? That's why I want the family to be hanging out with each other. And I'm not saying it's just the council. I'm saying it's everybody, but... I do I mean, see. I, with I do. I do see and, some uh, other people like make more of an effort. Well, you get what I'm saying, yeah? Yeah, but I mean, I hang out with the people that are around when I wake up, like Terry and Smalls. I do shit with them. Mm -hmm. Like uh, when Axel's around, and we're not like a group of six. Like I hang out with them. Nike, like, uh, thank you for the raid, bro. So like, I mean, appreciate you, brother. Like, it's just cages sometimes that we just like don't uh, don't clap, don't don't mesh sometimes. But like, he's still my family, he's still my brother, so. Yeah, I mean, listen, I know you guys at the end of the day, you care about each other still. That's not what I'm doubting. No. It's, uh, I think we are forgetting uh, the things that we can do when we're together and we're not just making fun of each other, right? Yeah. You know, no, no, less teasing, less memeing and actually going around getting shit done. Like, <laughs> it's, there is a difference, you know? Like, if you meet me and we're going for a meeting, right? I'm there and next to me is Smalls. And we're talking to somebody that, you know, been around the city for a long time. You think they will understand, they will know who Smalls is? You, you know what I'm saying? And I'm not, I'm, and he's getting yeah. there. He's trying to grow. But my thing is that we always forget, like, come on, rocking up to a minute. I got JJ next to me. I got uh, KJ. I got Reggie. People, people know who they're dealing with, you know? And opinions can yeah. be formed a lot better. That's all I'm saying. No, you're right. You're right. I get what you're saying. Yeah. Let's just try. Let's just try. Okay. Try for I'm me. Try for Seaside, man. What? Yeah. I'm going to, I'm going to tell, I'm going to tell KJ too. stop, f stop fucking shit steering every single fucking minute with you. And if he does business, like motherfucker, like bring me with you instead of just like tossing me aside kind of thing. Like I I'll help you, but like, or I'll back you up. But like, he just like. Like the second business pops up, it's like shoves you to the side, and it's like, okay, it's uh, bye. I'll yeah. see you later, kind of thing. Don't worry, I have a plan soon. This is shit's changing. I'm gonna make the council do my business. <laughs> right. Kind of scary. Come on, dog, get in the car. How's that scary? At least it's a common denominator there, right? And if you guys want to make fun of anybody, you can make fun of me. Smalls, <laughs> in the car. In the... Smalls, uh, Smalls, oh, I did not Smalls, this no, is not okay, Smalls. Smalls, what the Smalls, this is not okay, buddy. Whoa, whoa, 